Hey people, this is Kelly of Print, Pray, Slay. I am here to do a special reveal of a kit that is coming out on Thursday um, and also to use the kit that came out last week. So these three listings that are going to be new to the shop are from my very dear friend, Crystal, who owns Pretty Planners Unite. South Carolina, which is SC. So, Crystal is very talented. She designed these uh, couple pages that I'm about to go through. So, this first set is called Neutrals. So, this is a background that you can do as an overlay. You can punch tabs in it, um, cut into strips of washi. There's a variety of things that you can do um, with this background. And I love the colors. The color uh, palette is very, very neutral, very nice. So it goes with a lot of things, especially uh, with that pink in there. Um, this one as well is a part of the neutral set. Um, and this one adds a little bit of blues into the mix. Uh, this set right here is called Masterpiece. And it's all about how um, God created us, of course, uh, I love this one. This quote right here says, the master's piece. So his workmanship. Uh, and she gives references right here to uh, four different um, scriptures. But she also included these cute little paint buckets for scriptures that you want to include on your own. So I'm going to be using a bit of this kit today. Um, and... What else am I? Oh, I'm going to be using this as well. So this is the other part of Masterpiece. I'm going to be using um, some of these very, very cute um, splashes, which also incorporate some um, word art in them. I think that is so neat. So you can see the word art through it. So whatever's white, because um, this is printed on um, paper right now, uh, but I printed these on clear sticker paper to be used later on in this video. But whatever's white will show whatever's through it. So if you have text underneath, like if you put it in the Bible page and there's words, the words will show through these little um, white spaces. Um, but we have love, peace, hope, joy, faith, patience. So those are a lot of key words that we use in a lot of our pages. Uh, the next set of the three, and this is the last set uh, for Crystal's release, is Outside of the Box. These are so cute. So I love... I don't know why my favorite part and it's so simple, but I like that. I feel like I can use them a lot is the note and living word. Um, I feel like I'm going to get a lot of use out of these in my um, planner and my Bible journal. Like I feel like these go with everything. So, but these on this side are highlighted in yellow and blue to coordinate with the different boxes. These boxes can be used as overlays over top of scripture or as journaling boxes. So I really like those as well. And these, of course, are um, art splashes. Um, and I like the contrast and color on these. And the last page of the set for Outside of the Box are these cute little office tools. So um, <laughs> these are pay, uh, paper clips and little thumbtacks. Aren't they really cute? And um, different notebook papers and a chalkboard. Um, so I really like black backgrounds because I get to use my gel pens. I like to write with my gel pens and they really, really pop on black backgrounds. And then of course these are post-it notes and my post-it notes definitely, um, get little dog ears like these and curl up. So I think that's a really realistic view of them, but I like how cartoonish the notebook paper and everything looks. So I'll be using two of these in today's, um, spreads as well so today i'm going to go over items in this kit as well as items in a kit i released last week which were the new wake pray slay dolls they come in three different tones and today i'll be using uh, the deep tone dolls so i'm gonna dive right into the process video So this first set, I'm going to use the new Bible that I revealed in the last video. Um, you can see an unboxing of this cute little Bible. Um, this Bible was on sale for only $10.99. So I thought that was a great deal. Um, so I'll be using it today. I kind of pre-planned where everything is going to go. That's just how I do everything. <laughs> because I don't want you guys to be um, waiting while I 
get things together. So clear sticker paper is what I printed um, everything on except for this Wake Prey Slay doll. So this kit um, is about coffee. Um, note to everyone, shocker, I don't really drink coffee. I prefer hot cocoa. I'm a hot cocoa girl. Um, but I understand that a lot of people like coffee and I, I mean, I like the taste of it, <laughs> but I just prefer hot cocoa. Um, so, uh, this kit, um, it, it's, it's a fun kit. It's a fun kit about how everyone likes their morning coffee and everyone claims to need it. They're addicted to it. And a lot of people like their coffee strong. So that's what this quote up here is. My faith is strong. Just like I like my coffee. It says Jesus Java. And I only need Christ and coffee on days ending with Y, which is pretty much every day, right? <laughs> so um, for this uh, entry, I'm in um, 1 Corinthians 16, and I am on verses 13 and 14. Be watchful, stand firm in the faith, be strong. This version right here says, act like men, be strong, uh, but my study Bible says be strong uh, it says let all that you do be done in love so to me that verse is talking about being strong in my faith um, having uh, a strong faith is important because there are a lot of obstacles that you come into in life and without that strong faith you'll you can crumble it, it can be devastating if you don't have faith in God and if your faith in God is not strong enough to withstand some of the things that come to you in life because life is going to have those tough times so I'm going to first glue down the girl again I like to do <laughs> my glue stick and I like to do the, the biggest item first so I'm just going to tack that down really quickly this is my first time working in this Bible I'm actually not that nervous working in it for some reason I guess I'm just getting it done So I like printing on sticker paper, but I think colors pop way better on cardstock. I just think they do. Uh, she looks gorgeous on cardstock. Um, she looks really, really nice on clear sticker paper as well. I just know that um, that um, the colors pop more on cardstock. I think my Jesus Java is cricket, and that is okay. I think I'm going to put this one on first. So these are um, the freebie from last week, which was um, what's a freebie called, um, good gracious, what are these? These are spills. So spills from um, coffee. So coffee spills. I thought I had a piece of paper on here. Yeah, I did. Okay, when I do process videos like this, you guys, I know that they end up being um, fairly long. So can you please let me know if you would ever prefer me not to do the process video outright and just, um, you know, do the speed up version? Because um, I kind of like to talk. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to save this for something else because <laughs> uh, I honestly plan on doing a lot of spreads today in this one video uh, I tend to like to do a lot of them at the same time so let me know how you feel about that um, that's making my videos kind of long but I know that some people um, really like to watch Facebook that long and some prefer that you get to the meat and give them a five minute video um, I just feel otherwise. I really like um, the longer videos where someone really is explaining a lot and um, showing me their actual process and talking me through how they're doing something. So I like that um, this clear sticker paper allows you to see the text underneath. Thus I'm able to get a more realistic um, feel when I do my um, spills 
So it looks like I really spilled some coffee in my bowl. But I didn't. Ain't that neat? I love it. So I printed out a few of these spills. And I'm pretty much going to... I don't want to use that one. Kind of cut it off on accident. Because I also want to put these in my... Um, my planner so that's why I print it so much so because this is big oh and look what Avery did for me <laughs> so I didn't have to um you know cut it or do it down a little bit less let me see and I'm hoping that these words show up really nice so I want to roll it since it's kind of big this clear stick of paper don't play once it's down it's pretty much down so I'm not gonna do my journaling right now what I'm gonna do is kind of do all of my spreads just to show you how to use everything um, but I am probably gonna either highlight or underline this verse and then I'm gonna write about what it means to me kind of what I've already explained to you guys um, but I'm gonna do that um, off camera and you can see what it looks like in my Instagram so this is what the um, Bible journaling page looks like about my strong faith with my strong cup of coffee, aka hot cocoa. <laughs> so, thanks for watching on that. The next is going to be a faith planner. So, I already took the liberty of cutting these out. These are on cardstock. I do not print on clear sticker paper if I plan on writing on it. I've never written on clear sticker paper, but I am just assuming it will not work out in my favor. So these are on cardstock because I plan on writing on those. So this is my horizontal happy planner um, page. And I have horizontal and vertical. I tend to do a mix of both um, because I like different layouts for different things. So I have scripture writing, I have devotion, I have um, uh, sermon notes, just a whole bunch of different things. So depending on what, I don't know why I tried to, why was I trying to put that on there? <laughs> so again, I'm going to um, put my glue stick on this child. So again, these girls are also from the deep, um, Wake Presley kit. The medium and light kits have different style of doll. Um, these are the African American dolls, and then there are dolls um, for other um, skin tones, and they have a different set of gorgeous women. Um, I did not print them, but they are over in the shop. And you can see what those look like as well. They are so cute. Um, one of them in particular that I really, 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 really like has this cute hat on. Um, I'm, I'm going to um, post it on Instagram because I haven't posted them on Instagram yet. I posted them in my stories. Um, but I did not post them on Instagram outright. But if you check out, my PR girls have been using... Um, these dolls as well in their planner spreads and in their bibles so you can check out how they use them but these are all dolls that have coffee cups teacups they are drinking their java and thinking about jesus that is what they're doing so ooh, where are you going so these three items are from crystal's kit um, outside the box and this one I believe is called Masterpiece yes this one is from Masterpiece so this is Hope I'm trying to tie in these pretty blues and yellows that are going on with the girls she has on a gray dress so that's very neutral um, and I just Crystal so, this is so cute <laughs> thank you so much Crystal I really really love it so this kit well, all three kits, honestly, that Crystal 
design will be in the shop on Thursday. And if you have signed up for my newsletter, which by this time, all these videos and all <laughs> posts that I've been doing, you should have the newsletter by now. Or you, or you should have subscribed to the newsletter by now. And you will get these kits for 30% off for only three days, though. So, um get in there while you can because after that it goes in the shop for full price so this is how i'm going to do this spread and then of course i'm going to do my journaling i probably put um, one something i want to highlight in this box and this box as well and i'm going to journal um uh probably my scripture scripture notes right here so that's going to be that i use a devotional i do my chronological life application bible study so there's different things that i use um these and let me make sure that I yeah I was gonna say did I um get it down right and I don't think I want to put any coffee on this spread maybe so yeah I think I will put a little bit of coffee on it but not the round circles I think I'm going to kind of just layer it on the sides cut it off and then place it somewhere else on another side am I cutting my planner paper okay about to say Kelly you messing up hmm. <laughs> that is not how you do that so if you cut on one side you can pretty much um, use the what you cut in another section and I think that's going to turn out nice hmm. hope you all think the same thing if you think I could have did something different you can please let me know but I prefer honestly that you just show me show me what you did <laughs> so um, tag me yeah no come on clear stick of paper <laughs> Cause stick of paper don't play. So tag me at print pray slay on Instagram if you use any of these items and want to share. Cause I know some people, um, you know, it is your Bible study. So I know that some folks are um, private with their studies, which is perfectly fine and understandable. Do I want to, do I want to merge this as if I made a splatter in the, no, I don't want to do that. I don't know why. I just didn't want to. And I like it around the corners like that. So no need to, hold on. Let me look at that again. <laughs> and here I am saying I, I did all of that for y'all. I had already planned it out. That does look nice, but I, I, I don't know where I'm going to want to write. So you can always add to it later. So you'll see on Instagram if I added another little splatter of coffee. Um, but I will call this done. So this is a horizontal plastic happy planner uh, using the coffee uh, wake place wake pray slay um, kit in the skin tone deep, and then crystals masterpiece masterpiece and well masterpiece here and outside of the box here. So that's two different kits for her. This next spread is also horizontal. These are weeks back to back. So I'm, I'm basically planning my September. Uh, some of these honestly probably should have already been done. But we're not going to talk about how Kelly is behind on her scripture writing. Okay, so that's the only clear sticker paper I used, I believe. Yep, everything else is to be glued. So I, I don't, I really, these are my favorite. <laughs> these are so cute. I just love these little note. Look at that note. Living word. So, so we got those down. And then this is another um, item from Out of the Box by Crystal. 
This is the cutest post-it note ever. And I'm going to cover up verse of the week um, as best I can. Because Stephanie really put it on there. And then Jesus is my cup of tea. And just to be honest again, I don't really like tea. <laughs> I am really a hot cocoa girl. But I know a lot of people like tea. And she is definitely sipping on some tea. So that's in there. Maybe I'll make a hot cocoa kit. There has to be some ladies and gentlemen out there that like hot cocoa like me. I'm really just addicted to chocolate. So if they could throw some chocolate up in some tea, then I probably would like the tea too. So this little bucket is where I will write what scripture I'm going to be um, um, studying for that day or that week. Probably the day. Well, sometimes I get into a um, scripture and even though I'm supposed to write it for that day and then write other ones, I'll go on this long just study and, and note taking on one particular um, verse. And that's quite all right with me. So I just sit there and bask in, in God's presence and what he is revealing to me in that particular study at that time. So this is a girl from what I used in the Bible, um, but this one is uh, purple. So the larger one is blue and the smaller one is purple um, as far as the shirts that she has on. And this girl also comes in uh, like a denim type blue. You know what? I don't want that there. The beauty of having a glue stick. <laughs> I wanted to use my um, washi tape. I don't really get to w use my washi tape because I wanted to do um, a prayer list on this side. Or just a highlight on that side. What is going on with this washi tape? Okay. So, um, this is already... But I know I want to use this one. So I'm probably going to use these two. I wanted to start with my thick washi tape. I never used this one. This one got the fresh cut at the top. Let's see. That about good. And I rip. I know a lot of planner girls do not rip their washi tape. They use a card and all that. Nope. Rips. I like it to just look like it is. So I got rips on this one too. And that will be where I um make my little player list. And then my girl, that's something about glue sticks. So if you don't use it, you might need to apply more. <laughs> because whatever you got going on may honestly not stick. If you do not put more glue on it. And this washi is from Michael's. It says, you are the God that works wonders. So I still want it to be a little rugged. But I got to be careful because I want the words there. Now, I know I want this washi, but I don't know where to put it. This is already hot pink. That already got washi on it. It will go here. Do, do, do. Okay, what else do I need to glue down? All of this is done. Okay. So that is my horizontal um, layout for my Faith Happy Planner. Well, the, the second horizontal. So I'm going to call this done as well. Make sure I glue everything down. <laughs> and be done with that. Okay, so lastly, we have this vertical spread. So some people don't know what to do with their vertical spreads because they are small boxes. So I tend to write really small, so I don't mind having the vertical layout, but 
I'm going to cover up a little bit of what's going on here. So these dolls are also from the Wake Cray Slay kit for coffee. Um, there were two separate pages. So one page was of the um, bigger dolls. And then we have the dolls that have like their whole outfits and everything like that on. So that is where she comes from. Dolls actually don't have any names. So I didn't name her. She's like Michelle. No. Angela. I don't know. She cute. That's what she is. She cute. And I have another bucket from Crystal. And these buckets, let me see what kitty buckets are from. Her masterpiece kit. So the buckets again are from the masterpiece kit. So you know what? I wanted to again work with Washi. I wanted to use this washi. So this washi says, hello, beautiful. And I do want these to be blunt cut. I'm going to cover up these lines. So I think, let's see how this goes. Nope, yeah, I'm going to cover it up. I think I'm going to start right here because I can't really see. I'm getting my card. I use this card for swiping acrylic paint and for cutting washing. Almost got the whole beautiful one there, but that's okay. Oh, I did. I got it. The whole thing was on there. Let's see. But if it, it's going to cut off, so but that's okay. I think I'm only going to do it on the bottom. Yeah, I think I'm only going to do it on the bottom. Okay, so that's my washi for this. This is where I'm going to use those items that I had once um, left off before. So I'm going to use the big one over here. I have to decide, do I want to do that? Because once I put it down, I can't write over top of this. So I don't know if I want to wait to put it down. So that it can be over the text that I want to write on the page. But I'm thinking not. I think I'm just going to try to. I think I'm going to leave some to cut off. Just to make sure I got it right. Yep. So I only have to. What is that? <laughs> Random washi. Okay. So I'm just going to cut off the access sticker paper. There we go. And the next one will go over here. Hmm. Will it also be at the top? Is that gonna look okay? Should it go off to the side? I think I want her to be cut off a little bit too. 
Let's see if I do it like that. You know what? I think I'm going to do something random in the middle. Let me see. Is that going to look right, Kelly? Before I, because you know, clear stick of paper don't play. <laughs> so before I put this down, is this going to look okay? I don't think I'm going to do that. I think it was a nice idea. But I think a better one would be having it up here, even though it's already got one up there. I think I'm just going to do it down here. Yep, I'm going to do it down here. I didn't want both of them on the same page, but I feel like I don't want to take away from what she got going on. Because she's kind of big over there. I'm just going to put down all my clear sticker paper first. And so again, here is where, well, usually on the vertical, this is where I do my Bible study. So I'm reading the Bible, um, the Life Application Bible in chronological order. And I love it. That is my favorite Bible. Um, I have two Life Application Bibles. So that's how much I love it. But one is um, chronological and the other is um, in the way that we ordinarily read the Bible. So... And by chronological, I mean in order of event. Um, so there are some books that are going to be out of the typical order that we're used to reading them in because they happened at a time closer to another part of the Bible. That um, so basically they're they're stated in the Bible by like date. So I'm going to cut off just a little bit. Of her hair, I know y'all like, I can't believe you cut that girl hair. <laughs> it is okay. So this is from my Faith Happy Planner. This is undated. I love it undated. Um, of course, it still has the days of the week on there. I can do without that also. But um, that's what Stephanie gave us. So, And by gave, I mean I bought this and she designed it. <laughs> so um i want to do something additional in here this is the last page so i wanted to do some so i know everybody has their fancy watercolors i do not um this is some watercolors from michael's i think they were five dollars so I like to do this thing I call smushing. Uh, my favorite journaler is um, is a uh, Allie Allie Brown, and I'm gonna pull some. And she, I believe, she calls it smushing. <laughs> but I will be trying to bring in a little bit of red onto this page. And I'm, this is just a package from a sticker. And I am going to smush it into here. That's it. Like, honestly, just smushing. And once it dries, it'll be a little decorative. That's my little art part. <laughs> my art part. Oh. But I do that quite often. And then I also have my splatters. I, but I don't know if I want to put my splatters in now or later. I'm probably going to put my splatters in later. I like the effect that it gave in the Bible. Where... It was kind of over the words, so I'm going to do that because I have a ton of splatters left over here that I'm going to probably plop down later. Like, that one looks nice. But again, I want it over my words, so you'll see it after I write it in, after I do my Bible study for the week that I'm doing this one in. So that is all, people. Let me um show you everything again. This is drying, so I don't really want to mess that one up. 
So let's let's talk about this one first. So I dropped my glue stick. This is the Faith Happy Planner in vertical layout. This is what this spread is going to look like. This is horizontal for one week. This is horizontal for the next week. And then I'm going to come in here and do my journaling here and possibly here. I might want to leave that blank from the verse that I read in 1 Corinthians. And again, I was using the Wake Pray Slay Dolls um, labeled coffee. The ones I was using were deep. And I was also using crystals items. Again, this is outside of the box. Masterpiece. And neutrals. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you like it. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe, hit the bell, um, so that you'll be notified of future videos. Please sign up for the newsletter so that you can get these items for 30% off. The Wake Pray Slay dolls are already in the shop. Um, they are no longer 30% off because they were last week's, um, item. And that also includes the freebie from last week is now in the shop. And that is the coffee spills. Thank you guys so much, Crystal. Congratulations on your launch. Love you. Bye.